The operators of Australia's largest camel dairy say they need to expand fivefold to become commercially viable. The Australian Wild Camel Corporation says raw milk is so expensive to produce, they're turning to beauty products to help boost their bottom line. Tom Forbes has the story. These impatient calves are waiting for their mothers to be milked. The dairy near Ipswich in southeast Queensland milks 60 camels twice a day. It may be the largest of its kind in Australia, but it's not commercially viable, with most people unwilling to pay $20 a litre for milk. To go from where we are now as a camel dairy to a successful commercial operation providing milk to the market at a price point where all families can buy it, there's a lot of work that needs to be done. The operators have decided to value add, developing camel ice cream, cheese and meat products. They're also dipping a toe into the beauty industry, launching a skincare range. Boosting the bottom line can also be done by increasing a camel's productivity. We've had, I suppose, camels from you know a litre a day to uh, up to 12 and a half litres a day. And a selective breeding program might smooth out the milking process. All of these camels were caught in the wild and trucked in. They had to be taught how to go through the dairy process. Some pick it up in a fortnight, others can take six weeks. Eventually, they'd like to milk a thousand camels a day, with a herd two and a half times that size. The outcome, Paul, and I'd like to see is that the Camel, Australian Wild Camel Corporation is, if you like, the catalyst for establishing a very strong and um, robust Australian camel industry. Working hard to get over the hump. Tom Forbes, ABC News.